January 1st, a day of new beginnings, fresh starts, and the opening chapter of our next journey around the sun. On New Year's Day 2019, Fulbright Malaysia ETAs bid final farewells to friends and family and embarked on their own new adventure. Both excited and nervous by the sheer weight of the unknown, we traveled to Kuala Lumpur where we spent two weeks preparing for the next 10 months of teaching. We left KL accompanied by new friends and motivated to make an impact in each of our communities. After documenting this once-in-a-lifetime experience, I asked fellow Fulbrighter and spoken word poet Zach Gordon to write a poem about what the year meant to him. Combining my footage with Zach's poem and backed by music composed by Borneo ETA Carter Sanders, Tari Mikase, Malaysia. Salamat pagi. It means good morning. Even when it is nighttime in America, it is morning in Malaysia. From the moment we stepped off our plane, everything seemed to be flipped upside down. The sun has a way of tricking you into believing it is only just waking up, that it's always breakfast time, or at least a good time for a coffee break. You cannot say Salamat Pagi without smiling. It brings a smile to your lips, just like saying cheese into a camera. Before we learned what it meant, we could tell what was being said. Welcome to our home. Please, take off your shoes and try to make yourself comfortable. The rice should be ready soon. Sikit Sikit means just a bit. It was our go-to response if anyone ever asked us if we spoke Malay. In this way, it really means, I promise you are better at speaking my language than I am at speaking yours. Sikit Sikit just a bit. While we learned a handful of words, our students knew thousands. Some knew more and some knew much less. No matter what, we practiced every day. Hello and I love you were standbys even for the timid students, the shy shy cats. And today it is too hot for work was a surprisingly accurate phrase for a country with a constant climate all year long. Trimakasi was the first and most useful phrase we learned. We use it to say thank you. Trimakasi for welcoming us with a smile and sometimes a parade. Trimakasi for the nasi, for the rendang, the coconut water and milo, and all the foods we never dreamed we could eat so much of in one class period. Trimakasi for the sunrises on islands and the sunsets after thunderstorms for helping us to fall in love, for feeding us when we got our hearts broken, and for allowing us to fall in love all over again. For the night markets, the holidays, the students, and the friends, Terimakase, Malaysia, for a year that rushed through our fingers as quickly and as pleasantly as an ice cube melting in each of our hands.